Maximilian Schell in The Man in the Glass Booth. The Man in the Glass Booth, on trial for history's ultimate crime. Why are you making it so easy for us? I assure you, I'm not. You really do need a lawyer. You do not understand. I'm going to win this case. The Man in the Glass Booth, does he speak as a criminal? Or as one of the victims? On the day of judgment, he comes before God and zap! If he sinned, he gets it. All the way from eternal damnation to a $10 fine. A little oversimplified. Maximilian Schell creates what may be the most remarkable portrayal of obsession and deception ever filmed. One of the most powerful plays of our age now becomes an overwhelming film. It towers head and shoulders above most other motion pictures. The unique, provocative subject matter of the man in the glass booth needed the guiding hand and creative energy of director Arthur Hiller of Love Story fame. Did you kill Arthur Goldman? Why did you do that, Mr. Goldman? When he spoke, at first, he would hesitate, his body stiff, his voice hushed, but then his body grew free. He would bang out his right arm like a hammer. Louder and louder he spoke, a torrent, a waterfall. The climaxes were shouted and shouted out and up and beyond. Und die göttliche Vorsehung wird uns bis zum Leinzig treiben. Why are you doing this to Mr. Goldman? Did you kill Arthur Goldman? Did you kill Did you Arthur kill Goldman? Arthur Goldman? Oh, 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 oh. Maximilian Schell glitters in the man in the glass booth. He is positively awesome. A cinematic and emotional experience like few you'll see this year. The man in the glass booth heats to a searing mystery. Daring, outrageous, utterly provocative, and strikingly effective. The man in the glass booth is exceptionally strong and gripping. The man in the glass booth achieves something rare and powerful. A fascinating film. I urge you to see it. The Man in the Glass Booth.